Well, it certainly is a night, isn't it? Hello, I am Zaisa for KQ from Longington, and you're watching me have a real weekend, apparently, because, dang, I have been awake and asleep and all kinds of things that just do not go together, apparently. Uh, it does not happen that I am both awake and asleep at the same time. Ah, uh, yes, hello, Star of Silver, hello, Song of Saria. Oh man, that is a good tr I always say it's a good track. It's a good track every time. If it wasn't a good track, it wouldn't be on the Falcom playlist, now would it? Ah. <sighs> Alright, now I'm just doing, like, social media stuff to let people know that I'm, uh, existent. You would think eventually I would, I would stop having to copy-paste my own, like, URL from my browser history, but so far I have definitely had to copy-paste, like, my own Twitch URL from my browser history, like, every time I, uh... Every time I do this. Oh, hello, Amber and company. My, uh... My web browser isn't visible on screen, right? Okay, good. I am scrolling down the, uh... B-Sky timeline looking for my own post and y'all are horny people y'all are really horny people on least on beast guy and i don't really mind it but i just really do not want my web browser to like show that fact to the entire universe get me twitch banned ah <sighs> so hello it is Almost Wild Arms O'Clock. And I slept in today. I was in and out of bed all day. Uh, I had a nasty headache from not sleeping. And then I am... I am just... Uh, you missed a few streams. You managed to cut Dingle properly. We did cut Dingle! We dangled our asses off, and then we went to Little Twister, and then and now we're going to Little Rock. And I don't have any jokes about that that I don't think Sari has already made. Little Rock, Big Rock, Arkansas. Yes, we miss the rains down in Arkansas. It's time to do a little bit of what should have done. What we should have done. But yeah, tonight's stream is us just arriving in Little Rock. Now I can begin the theme. Yeah, we did not, um... What you missed, Flair, in part, was uh, me getting stuck for about an hour on uh, a block puzzle blocks rise out of the sand and you have to walk across them except they also fall back into the sand so i fell into the sand a lot and there was sand and there was sand and there were blocks and there were sand and i died and i died and i died and i died and then eventually i made it but not before i died so, I am currently streaming from the land of the quadruple dead. And man, it's bleak down here. We got manticores everywhere. It's cool, though. It's fine. You know, we're, we're, I'm doing, I am, uh, I exist. I exist as an ancient form of life. Why did I close my web browser when, like, the walkthrough is in the web browser and I need the walkthrough? What am I doing? 
I don't know what I'm doing. I am, uh... I am a... I am a banana. Alright, we have kicked over. Let's shut down the music. Pop over here. Please enjoy this brief preview of coming attractions as we load up Wild Arms 3. And, uh... Get you guys down here. Yes, I'm full of potassium! And other valuable nutrients. Uh, even the title screen music is good in this game. So yeah, when we left off, we were just arriving in Little Rock. Let's pick that up. Uh, let's hit the... Let's hit the B button instead of the A button, or the cross button, because I am... used to Japanese controls from Hiotovo. Alright, opening movie. Gives me some time to, uh... Wake up. How snowballs like a mile away from the rest of the party during that scene. Thing this sequence needs is like a a little episode number it shows how many times you've loaded the game. But all right, we've arrived in a little rock. Let's uh let's hit the inn first because we need to. Oh hi! I finally reached this place and my mother has already moved on. But I'm happy. I'm happy. I know she's all right and I have the strength to go on. Yeah, that's what the opening movie's about. Having the strength to face a brand new day or whatever. It's cool. Thank you for existing. Uh, alright. Welcome to the Rolling Stone. We provide an evening filled with beautiful music. Alright. 360 yellow for the whole crew. Filled with beautiful music, huh? Up oh, barrels. Yeah, they're the Gemmel coin, naturally. And a bookshelf. Gaspar's Diary catches your eye. May 20th, sunny. Was a hot day from sunrise to sunset. Weather like this, I wish I was sailing. Sorry, Daddy, I don't want to follow after you. I want to be a sailor instead. It's so neat to venture out into the ocean blue, with every day a new adventure. When I grow up, I'm gonna leave this dust-ridden town and sail the seas. Just you wait. Alright, big ambitions. Let's see if they pay off. I have no idea if I'm ever gonna meet this dude. Nope, there he is. Uh, this does not look like a man who has been sailing for the rest of his life. When I let Vaughn take over this place, I did a little remodeling. We closed the shop for that, but Milu said she wanted to pay back the loan as soon as possible. 
So I found her a job at a saloon owned by a friend of mine. Never thought I'd get to meet her daughter. Alright. Just, like, seeing if there was, like, white hair solidarity. Now, I'm curious about, uh... What does listen do? Oh! We got a sound test! I love when games include these. I have no idea how often you can actually get back to town to hear it. Oh, Milu! Yeah, she's quite a fox. If Gaspar had a partner as cute as her, but he'd work 20 times harder. Alright, uh... Where to? The Rolling Stone gathers no moss. It's always fresh and hip to the beat. Yeah, there's no names, but oh well. Come on into the Rolling Stone, your source for finer music and cuisine. Cuisine. You know, cuisine. It's what you eat. Uh, this well does not give me an ominous message. Oh, I've heard about you. You're friends with Pike, right? Any friend of his is a friend of mine. You're always welcome here. Yeah, the, the potion to kill cuisine. That cuisine. Oh, you're the one who saved Pike. Well, this is where we live. Little Rock. Used to be a bustling mining town, but now, well, we ain't mining much anymore. Let's see, uh... Whoop! I walked out of town. Hold on. Yeah, let's turn around and go back in. It's a bustling whining town! I'll use this frying pan as a drying pan. Boxes. Boxes. How did I even... No, I want that. I want that. A duplicator. Yes, good. Excellent. Boxes. 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 No foxes. Yeah, do you believe in guardians? I hear there's a guardian shrine just north of here. But look at what it's done for us. Maybe the guardians lost all their power eons ago. Maybe we just lack faith. Yeah, boxes, 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 boxes. Boxes are contained in the boxes. Sometimes. Sometimes you just get a whole box of fox. Mini carrot. Look at my little alcove. Let me take care of all your arm needs. Hey, weren't you looking for the crystal flower? That's too bad another drifter got it right before you did. But if it weren't for you, Pike wouldn't be back here again. Thank you. Uh, let's see. I'm just gonna... Yeah, you, you can box. You can fox. You can fox in a box. You can box foxily. The choices are yours, and yours alone. Um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna pump crit on Delos's shotgun a little bit. I was always disappointed, because, like, Fox and Friends sounds like a cute cartoon show, and it isn't. It's just, like, the six-minute hate. You find an old abandoned mine shaft. A pebble falls down into the darkness, and it echoes endlessly down. Looks like this one's finished. I could bust down the barricade, but I'd hate to get trapped in a cave-in. There is a treasure chest over there. Can I... No, I can't reach it. Not quite. My magic doll cannot reach the chest. 
This box will have to keep its secrets for now. What's in here? A name tag! I'm building up quite a supply of those. Barrels of wine stored among the mining equipment. It seems this is the saloon's wine cellar. Wines at best are kind of primitive. I'll have to do a little wine tasting at the saloon. Yeah, I need to learn, like, platforming maneuvers. I need to have, like, the jump bracelet or something. The rock feather. Uh, Heelberry, those are... Those are proving to be in a uh, fairly short supply right now. Some guy's house. Is that it? Ah, uh, you're friends of Pike. Yeah, sure I am. There's a bird. Hi, bird. And there is... Some barrels, some boxes. No oh, foxes. Some sandbags. Really? There's nothing? It feels like there should be something in here. Ah! A dragon fall. Okay. I knew there had to be something in there. Okay, let's see, uh... Is there a merchant here? I don't see one. So let's save. Again, you know. And now I will pull up my... A dragon fox? A dragon fox would be useful. I could go for a dragon fox. I got no reason to, uh, not want one. Perhaps this was some kind of guard hut? The boards are faded with time and now only rattle in the wind. The line of defense against monsters, she looks awfully frail for that, though. Alright, um... So... Call our horse. Uh, according to this guide, we should head north and search around a bit. I'm pretty sure there is... Oh, hi. Glimmering Emblem. Um... I don't think that's what we're looking for, actually. I mean, that is actually what we're looking for. But I don't think we're going there yet. Uh, let's see. We're looking at... Oh, man. No. These are... Hmm... Yeah, we're supposed to be at coordinates like X700 or something, so uh, I don't feel like I'm in the right place for whatever this is telling me to go to. Unless I just want to keep writing. Uh... Yeah, I think that must have been a transcription error. Keep going north until you reach the edge of the land, then head west. Until you reach 23,935. Y16103. I have no idea where the frig that is. 
coordinate systems are hard. Let's go shopping. But it does suggest that we just keep heading north, which is not the way that we're going. So we should keep heading north, actually. You can't dismount here. No, I didn't want to. The X700 means I got a screen wrap to my right. Oh, well, that would make sense. But, uh... Twenty-three, nine hundred... But yeah, I'm just looking for a particular, like, secret thing or something. And I am way- I am, like, miles off. I gotta head more to the north. Or morph, as it is known. But not here. I think I got lost, is what I did. Oh, there's a ravine. Let's jump this ravine. Stop encountering me. Stop randomly encountering me. Yeah, now I'm down south. I am way, way miles out of the way. Let's ride back across here, and, uh... Reevaluate my priorities and my position. Oh, hi, what is this? Always save regularly. It's a sure path to success for us drifters. Getting the memory card may start to take longer, but it must be done. Oh, thanks, man. Alright, this is the edge of the land. I am at, uh... 23 and 6 on er. Okay, I think this is it. What is this? Doomed to obscurity. This is the place. Head up. Uh yeah, this was where um Snowball started off. But there was some treasure we couldn't get. So we're going back for it. Because we always go back for treasure. Going back for treasure is good. It is the job. Wiggle up here. Yeah, you remember this treasure? Now we can get a Migrant Seal. That's what we were here for. Now we're headed back to, uh... The, the Glimmering Emblem Guardian Shrine thing. Oh, just keep jumping down. Keep jumping down the pyramid. But yeah, I did not duck off and get, like, the 5,000 bucks that's hidden out here in the desert somewhere. Uh, that will remain a mystery for another time. Well, do you sense anything? No, not I. I do not even feel the sense of discomfort brought on by Janice. Or the sense of exhaustion when the Guardian energy is depleted. Maybe we're the first ones here? No, I don't think so. You sense something? No, no, I don't sense anything. That's the problem. The sensation we're supposed to feel when the Guardian's life force energy flows. You mean to say they've already done their deed here? I don't know, I hope not. Let's go. We have to find out what happened here. So I am being warned that this is a difficult dungeon in terms of enemies, and I may need to do some grinding. So, uh... Let's engage and see just how bad they are. Oh, gobs. Hobgobs. 
These gobs, they hob. They don't seem terribly difficult, though. Ow. Gobs, revenge. Revenge of the gobs! Ah, let's hit that with some magic. Go gob to go- ow! He went gob to gob on me! That hurt! Fine, I guess. Uh, I might have to retreat to the hotel. Okay, I can. That's good. Yeah, you can see that I'm... It's doing the same thing that I'm doing over there. Alright. This has got to be better than, like, Saga Frontier Mirror Puzzles. Like, you gotta... I gotta give it that. You do not, act under any circumstances, have to add it to Saga Frontier Mirror Puzzles. Yeah, the Luminous Labyrinth. I, I kind of hate that place. It's what stops me from getting light magic a lot of the time. Like, I actively prefer getting shadow magic. Because... Ow, stop, no. Yeah, I mean, you find a treasure chest. A booby trap is set. Kick it. Trap disarmed. That's how we deal with traps around here. Uh, yeah, I am gonna have to head back to town more than once, I think. Get my recovery level up. Technically, getting shadow magic I don't think has any fights either if you're, you know, quick about it. Yellow card! Um, okay. What? Can I hit that with something? Okay, that's not what I expected. Oh, yeah, that's, that's fair. I have... 
less problems with that, but... It's still a pain in the ass. Regain the crystal's luster and the gate will open. Well, I guess I have to go up there and clean that window, too. Money! Oh. There we go. No puzzle's going to slow down Nancy for very long. Although I do wonder how I'm gonna... Nobody saw me break a glass of my face. Okay? Uh, Land of the Lustrous. God, I haven't seen that yet. I've heard it's like... Uh, I've heard it's basically Steven Universe, but gayer. Although if they're asexual... No, you'd be asexual and still be gay as hell. It's not really a problem. Mini carrot, hillberries, cool. That Nancy's magic feet needed, yeah, her magic face needed a break. Nancy's guilty gear has got no rhythm. Uh, what are you? What the fuck are you? Fairy lights. Oh, you you look you don't look good. You look bad, actually. I'm gonna shoot the hell out of you. Right? That doesn't feel happy. Don't do- don't do that. Don't. Yeah, I'm gonna have to head back to town, I think. Recovery is important. Miss. Okay, I'm gonna have to hit these guys with magic. Uh... Let's go with... Well, let's just shoot you. And you. Let's go with Refrigerate and, uh... Devastate. Refrigerate! Devastate! Yeah. Oh god, they're making emoticons of me. Why you- why you do that? That didn't help. That did. Ah... Summon? Moonspar? Okay. Pressure... Yeah, let's see. Merciless Queen! That did fuck all. Well, I guess I'd use, like, the wrong kind of magic.
Okay, now that I've opened up this, I'm gonna... Yeah, I use gravity magic. That's true, I guess. Oh, oh no. Okay, they're just gobs. I can take them out. I can take them out. Ow. 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 Uh, the nice thing is, the ambush song is a banger. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. I'm just gonna heal after the battle. There we go. Find a treasure chest, a booby trap, kick it. You explode and die. Uh, Nancy's dead now. What a shame. Alright, heal Barry. Heal Barry. Let's get back to town. We'll recover, we'll come back, it'll be fine, we'll just go straight in. Be fine, everything's fine. Town is this way. Town is this way? Uh, yes, town is this way. Well, to be fair, I've given Nancy, like, Two guardians, or everybody else only has one. Um. Right, I'm saving up to get him power cancel. Stay a while and listen! I stayed a while, I'm not listening, I'm leaving. Is there anything in town that's like... Arms fit? Well, yeah, I could improve some guns. I swear you know that riff from somewhere else, it's possible. Upgrade your hit percent. And... Uh... Shot strength. I'm just sort of upgrading my guns randomly, I admit. Probably there is an optimized way to do this. I don't know what it is. Uh, I'll go check guides, like, later in the game. After I've wasted a bunch of money. That's the Zazie Squirrelian way. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like the way they skitter. They are keeping up with my horses. I don't fucking like that at all. I would shoot them too. If I cared about... Uh, I would play Last Remnant, but I don't know if it's possible to optimize Last Remnant. Uh, in Last Remnant, everything just kind of happens arbitrarily. Now, if I wanted optimization, I would play, uh... Oh, what is it called? I would play that one game where you can clip, like, 14 different scopes to your gun. Residence of Fate. That's what I would be playing. No, Last Remnant is the, uh, the, the one that's like Saga, except you have a squad system that is enormously complex. Uh. 
All right, ladders. Let's go up one. Yes. Just go. All right. What is this? Um. No, that's not really what I want. I want to pull. Yeah, give me that. Give me some of that block. Oh yeah, rather than to fit, don't worry. Uh, if I wanted to play a JRPG where I optimize shit, I would play Resident of Fate and I would optimize the fuck out of my character's outfits. Have you seen the kind of outfit bullshit you can pull in that game? You can dress up so good. You can, like, force heterochromia on your characters. You can, uh... You can give everybody, like, fashionable glasses that don't do anything. You can, um... You can just do so much. And look so... You look, you look so good! Wait a goddamn minute. Okay. Yeah, um, I think I need to have this door open. Yeah, okay. Oh, I get it. I get it. I think I get I think I get it. I don't get it. Oh, no, I get it. I do. I do. I do. I gotta fucking move this. I gotta move this all over. Oh, no, wait. How do you... I, can, I certainly can't do that, can I? No, I can't go up like the half step. One moment. Then I just land stalker my way over. Okay. And then I hop down. Yeah, the mirror works both. It goes two ways. The uh, the door swings both ways, as they put it in Ghostbusters. God damn it. Alright. So yeah, no, I think I got this. I just... I gotta actually do this. I'm doing things is hard. It's just dropping. Yeah, I... I have figured out how to land stalker across a gap. That was part of the uh, block bullshit last time. Do you, do you little shits have any weakness? I don't think you do. Yeah. You like finding block puzzles, but wish that RPGs didn't make them so slow. Have you 
Uh, weakness is dark. Okay. There is a game that I want to recommend to you, but I want to make sure I get the name of it right. So, I'm just checking in the background real quick. Oh, no, don't use magic against it. I mean, do use magic against it. Just don't use normal stuff. Yeah, uh, if you're really into Chocobon and you want a plot that will apparently make your brain melt out your nose, you should look into a game called Void Stranger. Uh, half the people I know have been, like, super hot over that game since it came out because it is apparently the pinnacle of puzzle entertainment. And by puzzle entertainment, I mean, like, playing Sokoban, but also weird puzzle shit. I can say no more. I hope you enjoy it, should you choose to partake. Also, Baba is you. Well, if I was gonna recommend, uh, just any old... What's it? I would recommend, uh... What is it, like, Pascal's Parabox or something? Where you can go into a box that goes into a box, and that box further goes into a box? Patrick's Par- thank you. Stop random encountering me while I'm solving puzzles, you bastard! I'm solving puzzles! Don't encounter me! As a matter of fact, don't encounter me any other time either. I just don't want to be perceived. Ugh, but I need the experience. But anyway, yeah, I'm not recommending, uh, Patrick's para parachute. I'm- I'm recommending Void Stranger. Pascal's Parachute. That would be a very different game, actually. Ah, just getting slapped around for fun and profit. Yeah, Gilroy's gonna die. Um... Heal berry. Rusty, you can shoot. I know it's supposed to be Galloys. Or Gallows. Like, that's how you pronounce it, Gallows. But I am uh, allergic to France. Ah, fucking damn it, stop running. Alright. What's in the box? It's a random encounter! It's our next cartoon! It's a new car! It's Monkey Python Flying Circus! I don't know, I'm just... I don't know what's in the box, man. It's... If it's a severed head, I'm gonna be very disappointed. Now that I know how many hit points they have, that is kind of gross overkill. 
It's a good thing I like growth overkill. There's no kill like overkill. Find a treasure chest. Booby trapped it fed. You open it. You die. The end. At least we got another heal berry. What is in this box? A growth egg! What does the growth egg do again? Uh, raise his MTC by one. Right, I'm saving that for later. Because I understand that it gets harder to raise your mass transference capacity or whatever the fuck that stands for as you go up levels okay here you push the block not put push you must push the go block can i push this from the stairs i cannot Oh god, okay, uh... Over there. Push the block. There. This is much faster than just grabbing it by hand and manually pushing it. Why was I not doing this before? I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die of ambush! Uh, now you have the stream going on your laptop. Hello, Shikari! If it was you that I just recommended Void Stranger to, then the recommendation goes double. I understand it takes a lot of Sudoku to get to the point, but well, you know, if you're not if you're playing a Sudoku game and uh, you don't like Sudoku, it's not Sudoku. No, it's not. What the fuck is it? It's not Sudoku, it's the thing with the boxes. Wait, Coden? No. It's the it's the block pushing thing. I know it has a name. Focobon, thank you. And yeah, if you have to tag out and sleep, tag out and sleep. Uh, I know I got started late tonight. I got started at a stupid hour, and I'm winning stupid prizes. But, you know, I woke up late, and then Keldon was streaming. And Keldon is, like, uh, possibly one of my favorite streamers, and he's been gone a long time, so... I had to stop in and be like, oh my god, it's Keldon. Uh, okay. That lowered part of a thing. And now let me guess, you walk back and you go up the other side. 
Oh, Sokoban. Right, Sokoban. It's the net hack. Right, yes. Now entering the Sokoban sector. Be prepared. Do your best you have ever done. Okay! Uh, you just grab this. There we go. That's not working. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, there's two blocks. But there's three blocks here. Did I fuck that up? Did I fuck that up? Did I... One, two... One, two. Oh wait, the door did this is this a door? No, it's not a door. You know what a smoke bomb? You do it through quirk. Oh yeah, quirk. I did not like quirk at all. Quirk was a little piece of crap. But who on those shows wasn't a little piece of crap, you know? So Okay, let me go out and reset this. Yeah, torches too. I have the torches. They're in the right pattern, I think. One, two, three. Put this one out. Hold on. Damn it. Alright, I gotta... They weren't for a mirror image. Well, let me just do this random battle. No Mac for- people use Macs? Still? I wasn't aware that people were still making Macs. I thought they were, like, depreciated. Macs are still huge in, like, visual design for- well, I mean, I know that, like, Mac software is big, but I thought that, like, Macintosh was replaced with Linux or something. Like... I don't know. Uh, so this is not a mirror image. You're right, it's not. It's not a mirror image. How did I miss that? It's... it would be like this. No. No. Ah! Okay. random encounters, that's all. There's, there's just a lot of them, and they keep popping up when I'm trying to do something. I feel like I'm playing fucking Xenogears. <laughs> Thank you for killing the main character of Wrath of the God. Yeah, now somebody's dead. I got impatient and somebody's dead.
as much as you hate it. Yeah, the thing, yeah, it kept going when you were in the middle of a jump. That's, that was like what I was thinking of. Uh, Dreamcast Sky of Arcadia was God. Dreamcast Sky of Arcadia was bad, but... Now, I think the worst encounter rate is still like NES Mother. Mount Etoy. It is just constant and relentless. We don't talk about Mother- I'm talking about Mother 1. I played it. I get to talk about it. Okay, you know what? We're going back to town. We're going back to town. Cannot work under these conditions. Uh, you, puzzles, please stay finished. Anyway, we need, uh, like a recovery burst. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. But yeah, we need to... Oh god, I don't know how to leave. I don't actually know how to leave. How the fuck do I get out of this dungeon? Uh, there may be some technical difficulties. Okay, I think I go this way. I'm trying to leave, I am not going the wrong way. You're right, I need to go around this plaque. And just keep going straight. And this is a way out. I'm good. Cool. Awesome. Amazing. Well done. Let's go back to town. Let's get healed up. Back to town is the other way. Thank you. For, for the, uh, for the doo-doo. No, no, no. Not, not thank you for the doo-doo. Thank you for the dun-dun. <laughs> Uh, thank you for killing Jarek from Mortal Kombat. And I love that scene. I, uh, I really love the iconic screams redeem and the hypnosis redeems and I love I love everything that's happening here today with you guys and there is so much happening on this planet and I'm sitting in this stone like it's some sort of coffin the same thing happened to me you know the same thing happened to me I too was entombed with nothing but the internet to keep me company uh, it was called high school. Okay. Let's get back at it. We've recovered. We're good. Everything's fine here now. No, I go the other way. I am just the best. I am the best navigator. I do amazing with the t I do do 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 amazing with the things yes thank you all right now I pick this up 
plus this. It's a mirror. Yeah, cool. Okay. Alright, what's this? Yes! I will take them. Another duplicator key. A gimbal quote. Let's fucking save. Let's fucking mix save. Let's mix fucking save the mix fucking game. Yes, I can, can, can! What I'm trying to say is maybe you ought to save. I have saved my game. I am saved! And we're going down and into the room which has presumably stuff in it. Whee! Mirror! Bum, bum. Yeah, I wouldn't worry to. Oh, for frig's sake. Am I gonna die again? I'm gonna get killed again. I am gonna get killed again. Let's barbecue these emoticon dudes. I don't regret this at all. barbecue these shanks. Yeah. yeah. I felt bad about doing this. I don't feel play, bad at all. It does not feel bad. More. I feel good. I feel happy. I fuck you. I'm fucking hitting my wicked fucking character. I'm gonna cram these gems up your butthole. <sighs> it appears we are too late. Everything is in shambles. Why would they do this? What do those people plan to do with the Guardian energy? What do they mean by transforming the planet? Don't worry, there must be something we can do. Flash hit acquired. The Guardian must have mustered its last strength and left this medium for us. Situation might be bad, but... The Guardian wanted us to have this. We gotta do something. Looks like there's another surprise in store for us. What? Keep us company? Give me a break. Okay, uh, let's actually equip that real quick. I am going to give this to, uh, Gallows. Can I assign some personal skill points? Uh, SOS Invisible. Removes you from the line of fire when your hit points are critically low. That's nice. Raise the probability of making the first move in battle. Oh, that's nice. Okay, you can have that. All right, uh... Mono Eye Titan. Oh my god, it's a Zaku. Um... 
affect your burst of laser fire. Yes. Converts lost vitality into physical strength. Yeah, I need that. I do need that. Eyeball. Shoot! Uh, don't forget to use a yellow card. Well, let's get her, uh, FP up. Here's a Gela card. Her lost vitality and a physical strength. Um, what does this do according to... Raises the target's attack power by the target's max HP minus the target's, target's current HP. Okay. Oh, okay, so yeah, he, he can really use this. As long as he gets hit. Good. Thank you. Uh, that didn't seem to do much. Alright, Mystic us a lucky card. Everybody unload. Big experience. Big prizes. I love it. How the eye rolls back whenever we hit it. That's that feels nice. That feels comforting. Oh, we shot it to the head. A dark ring. Yeah, that was not a problem. Uh, adds personal skill that nulls dark. Hmm. Oh well. Keep moving. What's this? What's this big thing in the jig? I've seen it before. The stigma of Filgaia. Could this be the control device called the Chalk? The Chalk? Chalk, chalk, chalk. Chalk, 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 chalk. What's a stigma? Hey, not bad. You really are an archaeologist. A stigma? And what's a chalk? Stigma balls! It's kind of like a symbol of sin. The sin committed by mankind. A long time ago, humans used the Guardian energy to stop the world from decaying. They have a lost prehistoric culture viewed the Guardians as living bio-plants and sealed them in rural locales of the world. The world is feeding off this Guardian life force and continues to survive. No! That can't be true! Those bio plants of the time exist today as the Guardian Shrines. And we, the people of Baskar, are the descendants of the plant protectors. However, even with the power of the Guardian Shrines, we are unable to stop the world from decaying. We know that much all too well. The power that sustains the world? These words directly signify the existence of Guardians. 
guardians help maintain world balance while acting as a pillar, preserving the planet itself. This thing is like the original sin we continue to carry on our backs. Did the entire dev team, like, autograph it? Because that's what it looks like. Living on this planet means carrying a burden of sin. I know it sounds crazy, but it just gives us more reason to live. We can't let the Guardian support go to waste. Yes, I know. That's why we have to protect the Guardians. Yeah, I hear ya. It's gotta be us. It's gotta be. But yeah, it looks like the dev team autographed this thing. I'm kind of amused by that. What now? I believe they are trying to buy some more time. We don't have the time to adjust to their schedule. Uh, Hecto I Titan. Well, heck. All right, I'm gonna descend mostly. But I gotta get FP up, so. It's cool, she's dark warded. That's not hurting her much. It's gonna hurt them though. All right. Okay. Uh, Mystic as another lucky card. Um, drop a mini carrot. You use the yellow card. Just defend for a moment. That sucks right now, but it will improve. Yeah, Valiant is great. That's not what I'm going for right now, though. I've, I've got to reflect this endless bullshit. Also, hello, Silent Knight. And, uh, happy Newt's miss to you, too. I imagine. Just toss off a heal. Alright, I need to... Everybody get Reflect up. Yep, it's you and it's, uh, Claire who should be in bed. Who should be in bed. If you're not in bed, go to bed. If you're not, uh... Anyway, get some sleep. I will be playing for at least another 40 some minutes. Alright, now let's unload. Dark matter, dark matter. Oh. Oh, you're weak to that too. Beautiful, this works. Anyway, sleep well, Silver. You'll, you'll probably be able to find this VOD tomorrow if you want to watch the rest.
<laughs> oh, this works better than uh, I thought would happen. This works better than I thought. when bosses can't stop killing themselves. Let's go. What does this have to do with transforming Vilgaia? Yeah, I've been wondering, man. Are we strong enough to carry this burden? Program heart possession complete. Current sequence stability at 168H slash F mark and rising, continuing to monitor measurement. Gemini circuit function normal. Recording peripheral phenomenon. Stand by for analogism expansion, auto level OS. Camouflage at 95% completion. Shifting limiter level green to yellow. 308 seconds per feet till energy cycle defaults to 70. I don't think that's seconds per feet. Everything clear, code name Divine Fortress, ready on command. The fortress created by the gods. The legacy of wisdom will finally take shape and activate. One of our goals is achieved. Come before us, Divine Fortress. Asgard shall be your given name, and you are to our shield us as our Aegis. The Golem Asgard, created from the wisdom of Hyades. The hidden sparkle in your arm shall become a barrier, capable of withstanding mighty force. Your enemy shall be everyone who stands in our way. Crush all enemies to pieces. Now come before us. Oh, is that it? What? Well, he's big. Huh, this piece of junk. Can this thing really fight? It's reprogrammed for tactical mode. All related options are in place. See to it that Asgard regards this place as a battleground. What the? A Contra Annihilation Barrier, Asgard's main arm, hence the name Divine Fortress. That's not what I wanted to know. Why is this clunker attacking me all of a sudden? Can't dis it distinguish who the enemy is? It's still fresh, so its behavioral pattern parameters may still be unstable. It needs more work. Looks like we got off on the wrong foot. Me and him don't seem to get along. Sorry, but I'll pass on the workshop class. Later! Smell you later, losers. Janus Oak out. So, it's the auto defender system we need to work on. Yes. It's been programmed to attack those of a certain level of fighting spirit at its own discretion. This will be of great use to us! How marvelous! There are two types of people in this world. Those who use, and those who are used. Yannis Cascade, which might you be? And us. <laughs> Love me a good evil laugh. Love a good evil laugh. Alright, let's hit, uh... Let's go back and hit the, uh... Hit town, rest up. Divide personal skills and stuff. Town is back this way. Whew.
Hey, a while and listen. All right, let's uh find these personal skills. I think I gotta save up for SOS Invincible, but I also want Poison Barrier. Like, at max. Uh, easy fight? Good! I don't know what you're talking about, but good. Uh, yeah. Dark Ward's been saving us, but I kind of want FP save. Oh, the boss fight I was in? Yeah. I I just had to work out to use, like, Reflect, and everything went okay. I understand how we rely on things. On a form, you can reach out and feel with your own hands. But the formless are never broken or destroyed, like music, for example. It's true, if you have... If you have no body, you are technically indestructible. And that is a comfort. Or as a wise man once put it, an object at rest cannot be stopped. Drifters are people who relish living under the skies of the wasteland, right? Sometimes I get jealous of the lives you get to live. I just wish we'd all move out of this town together. Aw, oh, well thanks. I want to move out with you too. I once heard the gems are only found near Leyline, the path to the planet's life force. Like ten years ago, at the laboratory to the northwest, a bunch of scientists were studying ley lines. They said they were doing it to make the world a better place or something. Interesting. Alright. Let's just, uh... Can't push you a little further. No, no, I agree. The formula should consume all. I think it would be a good time for them. I'm kind of making everybody do a little bit of everything, but I do think Nancy should have, like, high critical chance. That feels correct. Uh, as long as I'm here, let's sell off my... Assortment of gems. But not the ring. That's useful. And I really think you ought to have more shot strength. Probably ought to have more hit, actually, but, uh, oh well. Yeah. Moon Spark and Flash Hit don't have anything yet, so. Personal Skill that Nulls the Last, that sounds nice. And you can have the Dark Ring. Okay. All right, northwest it is. Let's north our west. Over this way. And I guess we're going over here. Somewhere. Waiting for the hero brave enough to north the- Oh my god! They're large! What are you? First corpse. Uh... I don't know how to cope with this. 
Alright, um... I guess let's just dump on them. Yeah, that's a lot of Undertakers! Blazers! These guys look like they're definitely weak to life. Yep, okay. More lasers! I kinda love that, actually. It's kinda fantastic. There's nothing here. Possibly over here. Uh, am I getting... I'm actually getting south right now, so I gotta keep northing. What are you, Twin Tails? Oh my god, you're very talented, aren't you? I'm gonna shoot you. Remarkable talent! Oh my god, you hurt. Why do you hurt so much? Oh, ow. No. Don't do that. Stop trying to sleep me! Stop using gravity! Drop breath mints? They're minty fresh! They're fresh and full of life until I shot them. Did I mention I'm a bad person? I'm a terrible person. Okay, we are really north and really west, and I don't know if we're northwest enough. We are extreme northwest. Uh, where the fuck are we? Where? Well, we're kind of more south than. Up, uh, ambush. Bye, what are you? Moth fungus. Moth is a fungus. Uh, I'm gonna set you on fire. Please do not resist for your own safety. Ah, uh, you're gonna poison me, aren't you? You're poisoning me, you bastards. Just shove your gun straight through Snowball's head and shoot. That's love. That's incredible. That's that's how the world was meant to be. Heads the size of walnuts being used as gun bracing. There is nothing the fuck over here. Yeah, hold on. Back up. Turn around. Right. Nope, I'm... Ah! Jump the ravine, horsey! Horsey, jump, jump. Alright, uh, I gotta have to go. I may have to go back to town and try this again. Oh, yeah, it's you. Ba -ba 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 Stop 
some dead meat. Pretty ball ball. This summer, Royce Eagle jump jump. This summer? That's actually quite a wait. Can we, can we jump before then, please? All right, I'm headed back towards town to uh, try see if I missed missed out, miss 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 to see if I screwed up. <laughs> see if I can't figure out which way north is. Okay, wait a minute. Wait, this guide has uh, coordinates. I will simply look at the coordinates. Please stop shoving your gun up Snowball's nose. Like, his sinuses are fine, man. You don't have to... Okay, what are the coordinates? Uh, 22793... 14... Something, something. Okay, I am... Um, I just need to figure out which is an X coordinate and which is a Y coordinate. Uh, Y seems to be moving that way. So X is moving north and south. So I need to move south from here. And it should be over uh, there, according to this map. According to these coordinates, that's that doesn't seem right. But it does imply that I went too far north. So I err, all right. Can I just drop a summon on them and take them out? Maybe. I like how we're still galloping along as this is happening. We're still riding along and this dragon's being summoned up alongside us. That's fantastic. I love this. Look, dragon. Yes, dragon! Ah, look, dragon! Big, strong! Oh, did I not cabotificate? Hold on. You gotta cabotificate for the dragonosities. That's just common sense. Antidote, Nancy. Antidote. Yes, you have to have Caboldification and Nation. I think there should be Caboldification and Nation in every nation. I'm watching the subtitles trying to figure out what the fuck I'm saying. And it's a beautiful sight. Alright, X... 22793. I am either too far north or south. Y14398. I am either too far east or west. So it's good to have that cleared up. Oh god, okay. Encounter rate is super high tonight. Blah 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 blah. Uh yeah, the more you summon, the more your MTC will go up. I just haven't had a chance to sit and like grind that out. Like, I've got it up to four, but I haven't really had a chance to sit and, uh, farm out summons to the point where I'm comfortable with my level of summon farm. But then I don't really, uh, use it much, so... Like, the only time I've summoned is to get magical gems to sell for more money so I could keep summoning. 
and keep selling gems. So that seems like a system that I'm not really engaging with at all. It really implies that it's up in this glove. That's... I've been all over that glove. There's nothing there. Yeah, selling gems is, is actually kind of fun. Yeah, like... I'm a little too high? Am I a little... Yeah, I'm a little too high up. I need to be... So, here? There's nothing here. I need a map. I need an actual map. I need an actual goddamn... Oh my god, cat. I need cats. I need more... I need to sell cats to the gem farmers. Alright, where is an actual wild arm for you? I'm cheating. World map. Uh, where? What am I looking? What am I looking for here? Leyline Observatory. That is dungeon number four, and I am up. Oh, that's nowhere near where I am at all. Need the sand cr Uh, not according to the guide I've been looking at. Alright, we're gonna duck back to town. Then we're gonna find the, uh, sand craft. No, we're gonna find what I'm looking for. We're gonna find the thing. Alright, that's nowhere near where I am, I think. Yeah, that is on the other side of this gap. Right here. More or less. So, either I need the sandcraft or I need to, uh... It's right around a big circle. And there's like a glove here. And you search the glove, and this is... where it says it would be. Like, it says it would be right here. Maybe I didn't get enough information at, in ta- Yeah, rat bastard. Alright. We found it. Uh, let's get back to Little Rock real quick. We'll recover, and then we'll come back here, and we'll actually do a dungeon. Oh my god. Where, where the hell is Little Rock? There it is. Can't dismount here. There's a mountain in the way. Of course there is. All right. Uh, this will be our last dungeon of the evening. I do think that, um... I do think I'm gonna stop at, like, two hours tonight-ish. Two-ish hours. I don't know how long this dungeon will be, actually. Uh, Monday, I am probably taking off. Almost certainly. Tuesday, I still don't really know which Christmas-themed hidden object game I'm playing, but we are playing a Christmas-themed hidden object game. Because those things are, are absolutely bananas go bonkers, and I want to engage with one. We will probably play a couple leading up to Christmas. And then I want to do sort of a, a, a year in review, ask me anything, sort of chatty stream. I've never done a just chatting stream. That feels like a gap in my streamer itinerary. Uh, I'm not going to get, like, topless for it, though. Oh, shit, this music. Ugh. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Why do I know this place? I have no memories. This is crazy. Oh, man. Did 
This music just fucking blindsided me. I am... Alright, uh... What's in here? Yeah, I'm gonna have to get challenged. What am I fighting? Targums and comic books? That's a manga if I ever saw one. Uh... Hey, you know what I bet they're weak to? Being set the fuck on fire. Oh, you know, no, no, don't do that. Who stopped that? And they cast magic, of course. It's fine, Nancy has Wind Ward. But yeah, more Dragon Time! Dragon Time for you and me. Dragon Time. Obliterate! Ah, uh, you find a treasure chest. Kick it. It exploded. That's, that's the normal reaction when you kick things. That's what happens when I kick things. A lucky card. Excellent. Couple heal berries. That's good. That's good. Um... A memorandum addressed to the Night Shift staff falls to the floor. Four of you will be assigned to the Night Shift this month. You must activate the elevator using your name as the password before you begin your shift. P.S. Bryant, please let Incapilla know. Benedict, you're last, so empty the trash before you leave. Any questions, ask Valette, who comes in before Bryant. Oh, God. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, open notepad. Okay, um... Uh, Benedict is last. Valette comes in before Bryant. Let me, let me review this. Bryant, let Incapila know. Valette comes in before Bryant, so... Valent, Bryant, Inca, Pila, and then Benedict, I think, is the implied order. Leyline Observatory catches your eye. The Leyline Observatory is funded by a special organization, where we research and study ley lines, an energy network that sustains the planet. By analyzing ley lines, we strive to refine the energy that sustains this planet. If successful, we will be able to deter the decay of the planet and breathe new life into the environment. May our blood and tears become the blessed rain, that's unsanitary, and our toil the light that warms the flowering greenery. We must bear the fruits of our research. Alright, okay, okay. Um, lockers, you said. Are there lockers in here? Okay. A white lab coat and personal belongings are covered in dust. An old candy wrapper. The expiration date is over ten years ago. The locker seems to have rusted shut. It won't open! A white lab coat. Radar. Press the square button to scan for hidden items. Cool. Okay. Lab coat. Lab coat. 
An old pair of socks gives off a sour, fermented stench. Oh boy. Lab coat. Okay. So, I'm allowed to, uh, radar now. That's nice. Okay, and then there was a room over here. Enter password. Uh... Bryant, please let Incapilla know. So I think... Um, I guess we got it right. Good. Generator on standby. Yeah, fermenting socks. I am- I have never been more excited to uncover treasure in a dungeon. Oh boy. I'm so hyped for socks. I'm not hyped for socks, guys. I'm being sarcastic as hell. Alright, what's in here? A dragon fossil! Veins circulating the subsurface. Underneath the crust of Fogaya lies a network of ley lines, which act as blood vessels to supply life energy to the planet. Atop these ley lines lie geologic stratum strong points, called ley points. It is interesting to note that many guardian shrines can be found atop of ley points. Not only do ley lines circulate the life energy of the planet, it is assumed they connect the ley points to amplify the energy mutually. In this sense, the ley lines and ley points are similar to blood vessels and organs in a living organism. This comparison paved the way for Fogaya theory, which views the planet as one single life entity. That makes some sense. Horse calls, good. I can call horses. Um. Device keeping the door shut. You must present your ID card. I don't have an ID card. Sealed by magic. Let's go ahead and, uh... Some may boast about physical strength, and some may boast about magic. How many of you boast about luck? Yo, me. Me. I do that. How many out there on the battlefield take luck seriously? Well, let me tell you this. That powerful one-timer, the critical hit... And the ever so handy defender? These skills are activated by chance and governed by luck. And what about those death blows of the various status ailments the enemies throw at you? Those can be prevented by skills and luck. And the booby traps treasure chest you get after winning a battle? The chance of you defusing it also depends on luck. It can be said that almost every action you take in battle is affected by luck. Having read this, I hope you'll take luck more seriously from now on. If you do, there's no doubt you'll emerge victorious in the wastelands. Ah, uh, the progenitors of the human race are said to have arrived on the planet long ago, on a ship that soars the heavens. However, there's no mention of where our forefathers came from. Without any absolute evidence backing up this folklore, many have come to view it as a mere fairy tale. On the other hand, there are those who take the folklore seriously, saying the fact that the human race seemed to appear in history overnight. I strongly believe that solving the mystery of the ship that soars the heavens will one day shed a light as the true origin of the human race. ID card acquired. Okay. Whose is this? No effect? Yeah, no effect. I wanted to look at it. Belong to a researcher named Pete. Pete? He's not on the list. ID card confirmed. Access granted. Nice. Okay, uh, in here. Nothing there. 
Gala. Gala. Gimmel. Duran's Diary. She came by again last night. Whenever I'm lost in my labyrinth of contemplation, she reaches out her tiny hands. Who is she? It may be wrong to define her as a real person. That's sexist. As long as I don't tie myself down with logic, she is just she. I'm at a point where I can't live without her anymore. I can't continue my research without her. I can't concentrate. I want to know more about her. I'm more interested in her than I am learning the mechanics of the generator. Adult Mag. Sealed by magic. Use a duplicator. You're not mature enough. Too stimulating for those under 18. Torval, can you read it? No. I'm level 20! Okay. I just wasted a key. I just wasted a key. That sucks. Oh well. Are you a mimic? You bastards. Okay. Hate mimics. Hate mimics. Uh blast them. Ba ba ba. Ah, uh, that did not kill him. Ow. Ow. Yep, yeah, we are not allowed to look at the pornography. Sorry, folks. There we go. Set the mimic on fire. It's made of wood. Come on. No. Uh, let's just Gatling. This is working. Okay. Yeah, I really thought we could set the mimic on fire. I don't, I don't know why we can't, but... Holy ank. Holy ank, Batman. Uh, nullify is bronze. More books! Beyond Oblivion. Skyrim? Come back when you reach level 18. I am level... I'm level 20. Demi-humans may look and think like humans, but they are different. Demi-humans called elves are said to have once existed on Kogaya. These elves are used to have... are said to have fought off the demons using the power of guardians. Originally, the elves were a peaceful race, but led by the blacksmith warrior Vassum, they fought to save the planet. Other men who are said to have been revered on an epitaph are Falcanelli, who performed the secret ceremony, and Vladivaski, who had insight about Solgaia. After the end of this bitter war, the Elves vanished and no one has heard from them again. According to one theory, since the Elves were closely tied with nature, they are believed to have died off from the decay of the planet. Are the Elves extinct? No one knows for sure. The demi-humid Elves have long been forgotten in the pages of history. Perhaps you will remember them when this planet returns to Verdu. Uh, the end of the Great War gave birth to the fundamentalism of nature, Baskar. Secret ceremonies were held using the powers of guardians, and two sects of Baskar were established. One is a religious group for those who had nowhere to turn to, and the other is the restorers of the decayed environment. Shortly after the flames of war had died out, it is said that Baskar has tried to rejuvenate Fogaya through the use of guardians. Guardians, which were continue, considered to be the power that sustains the world, were attempting to do just that. The Baskars were said to have set up chunks, a structure signifying the belief in Guardians over the lay point. Those chunks were used to suppress the expansion of the wasteland and at the same time amplify the Guardians' powers while supplying energy to the world. The spreading of the wasteland was more severe than expected, and the chunks only worked to delay the decay instead of revitalizing the environment. 
Both shocks later became referred to as guardian shrines and play a ceremonial role today. The rejuvenation of Felgaia would have to find a new, different approach. Uh, artifacts left behind from the Great War brought about a new power to the human race. Oh, migrant level 18. Okay, I'm gonna have to find a lot of seal. Machines capable of activation through the use of will as an extension of oneself. Artifacts from ruins, memories, otherwise known as arms. Artifacts from ruins, memories. Arfums? Arf we're Arfum users! We're all dogs here! Today, arms commonly refer to portable machine weaponry, but occasion originally it encompasses the technology used to make them. To these days, no one knows who these memories belong to, but the fact remains we have come to depend on its powers. That wasn't grammatically correct. Alright, let's try up here. Uh, what's up, guys? Pieces of experimental records still remain inside the console. On screen! The experimental record data was damaged. Repair! Zoom! Enhance! By piecing some of the words together, it appears the scientists were studying the formation of life from the ley lines. A data sample of the planet seems to have been constructed, but no further details are available. Sun. My only regret is I was unable to show you a world full of verdure. But wait, I will overlap the new world formation onto your figure. A new life. A life that must carry the burden for generations. Adam Cadmon, you are our only hope. Guide this Philgaia so it will once again be filled with greenery. You are the world's hope. I'm counting on you for all children of this planet. Oh, Nancy. The data inside these machines is still active. Yeah, it is. It wasn't my imagination at all. I know this place, but why? Without any windows and so many machines humming loudly 24-7, surprised the scientists didn't go insane. He knows this place. The data is still active. Uh... Uh-huh. Data structure of the planet. They overlaid it on this Adam Cadmon. Ah. Will the seven of us earn a place in history as the creators or as immortal sinners? That will all depend on the completion of the sample. The seven of us have come this far, so we can deliver another tomorrow for the planet. Implementation of the sample completed on time, adjusting time schedule by O2. Everything is proceeding smoothly. The project was feared to be blasphemy against divine nature, but the favorable progress helps ease our collective conscience. This is a significant leap forward to the theory. The outcome will be proven once the project begins to take shape. Adam Cadmon is about to be born. I can't do anything with this one. Not like I understand why I know this, but... Hmm? What are you doing? There! It opened. A secret door, but how did you find it? Surely it wasn't obvious. I don't know why, but I think I know this place. Actually, it's more like my body remembers it. He becomes more Shadow the Hedgehog by the moment. I love him. Do you think this place might have something to do with your lost memories? Who knows, but the fact is, I seem to faintly remember this place. Waving water, reflections of light, people in white lab coats, I wasn't alone then. 
Do not try to recall everything at once. It will be too overwhelming for you mentally and physically. There must be some kind of clue about his memories behind the secret door. Let's go find out. Let's let you lead. A giant cultivation device for organisms. Many tiny adjustment dials surround the pod. My stomach feels like it's gonna fall out and my neck's getting stiff. We need to leave here now. Uh, was that a computer terminal? Yeah, it was. The experimental record data was damaged. By piecing some of the words together, it seems to have something to do with environmental data and simulation patterns dating back a thousand years ago. It appears the scientists were trying to revitalize or transform the environment artificially. Okay, you know what? I am kind of mentally worn. So what we're going to do is we're going to save here. And this is where we're going to come back next time we play. I am going to leave y'all on a cliffhanger. I'm sorry, but it must be done. Things are certainly snowballing. They, they sure are. They sure are. And, oh good, Keldon is still streaming. I'm gonna drop you all over on Keldon, who is finally back from a long hiatus. Uh, playing Death Stranding right now. Hideo Kojima's big adventure. So you're gonna get dropped in on that. Remember, Tuesday, we do hidden object games. Or at least one hidden object game. Ridiculous Christmas-themed hidden object game. I'm looking forward to it. I hope you guys are, too. So, I am just gonna, uh... Make sure he's not about to quit. Nope. Doesn't look like it. And we're going to raid a big blue dragon that I happen to like. So, uh, please enjoy dragon time. Good night, everybody.